Hi, I'm Nemesis and welcome to another Forza Motorsport 4 video. I'm going to be looking at another car in Auto Vista. It's an Easter egg. The Warthog from Halo. This one is actually from Halo 4. It's a little bit of a preview. And the thing is, unlike every other car in the game, you can't drive this one. Or, and the Bentley, I guess. But you can't drive this car, namely because it tops out 78, which is not very fast. And... They could not simulate the tires, so they couldn't they couldn't get tire data on like every other car in the game. So they could not actually properly know the character characteristics of the car. And plus they'd have to build a whole new system special for this car just for the four wheel steering. And right here you see the explode what it does is open compartments all over the warthog. So it's just a little Easter egg. You can look at an Auto Vista. Can't actually drive it, unfortunately. Although they do show three different paint jobs: the standard green, the Arctic, and desert camo. Another thing they did was, rather than having Jeremy Clarkson kind of sputter, lost about it, they had someone else do the voice work for this car. The M12 Force Application Vehicle, better known as the Warthog, is a highly mobile and adaptable platform serving the UNSC. Famed for its toughness and sturdy design, stories about hogs surviving numerous tours of active combat duty abound. But none is more well known than the tale of the Daedalus. Near the beginning of the Covenant War, the UNSC frigate Daedalus went down in atmosphere over the planet Galgaliel, smashing into the irradiated world's high gravity surface. The ship's molten wreckage was scattered for hundreds of miles, an unsurvivable event. And yet, four warthogs had, in fact, survived the impact. Marines from the motor pool had buckled themselves into the hog's seats as the frigate plummeted to the surface. Strapped to the ship's deck, incredibly, the vehicles remained intact. Due to the security restrictions of the Cole Protocol, the Marines would wait months for aid. To survive, they used the hogs to desalinate water and search for food. And they even programmed their radios to broadcast the distress signal that eventually led to their rescue. So yeah, they got Cortana, Jen Taylor, which is pretty cool. Um, and right here we actually get to see what the engine looks like, which is something we don't really get to see often. The M12 uses a dependable, low-profile, 12-liter hydrogen-injected ICE power plant. In standard 1G environments, the hog has a maximum range of 490 miles before it needs to refuel. It can achieve a top speed of 78 miles per hour, no matter the terrain. Yeah, this is actually a very big vehicle, as you can probably tell. I'm not going to talk too much at this point. I'm going to pretty much just let the Cortana voiceover do most of the talking for me. Although, oddly enough, this is the one thing that does not have any voice work right there. It's a lighting system. The Hog's massive tires feature a reactive tread pattern that provides astonishing traction on nearly any surface. Burst-proof nanotube construction gives these tires similar buoyancy to their gas pocket counterparts with one key benefit. They're practically indestructible. The rear section of the Warthog can be configured to any number of purposes, including troop transport and weapons platforms. The versatile Hog sees daily use as everything from a mobile machine gun to an ambulance. As with most UNSC vehicles, the Warthog is equipped with a Graf Hauptmann solar saline actuator. This enables Marines to crack hydrogen fuel from any water source, reducing the need to transport bulky and dangerous fuel supplies. The Warthog's independent swing arm suspension is tuned for relatively low speeds and depending on the vehicle's loadout for hard braking, high g-forces, and variable centers of gravity. Oh. 
This M12 is equipped with an M41 turret-mounted chain gun with a 360-degree rotatable platform and compatible ammo feed, supplying up to 912.7 by 99 millimeter AP rounds per minute. All military warthogs are coated with a programmable nanoprismatic paint to refract color at any chromacity depending on the vehicle's destination. A security bit was designed to prevent Marines from tinkering with the finish based on early and embarrassing experiences of the tech's deployment. The M12 FAV is equipped with 20-inch magnesium alloy wheels and powerful 14-inch carbon ceramic disc brakes. The four-wheel drive, four-wheel steering M12 FAV features a manual shifted transmission and a steering linked emergency brake. Interior features vary depending on how the vehicle is purposed by AMG's factories, but standard controls include manual shifters and a steering-linked e-brake. A driver skilled in the use of this cutting brake can turn the hog on a dime. Well, that's it for the Warthog. Um, there's really not much else to it. Easter egg that you get when you complete all the Auto Vista challenges. And it's pretty cool. So, on that note, I'll reach you the end of the video. So, I'll see you guys later. Bye.